Hey guys, what's up? It's Brooke Lieutenant, and uh, today I just have a short review over the Minifig Co. Uh, Winter Panzer Grenadier. It's this new limited edition minifigure they released a couple weeks ago, and I got mine. I figured I'd do a review over it. So, uh, to start, it comes with this nice, as most of their special minifigures do, it's a nice case. Uh, well, it's not a case, really just what it ships in. Really nice quality. Got some stuff on the back. If you want to pause it, you can read that. Just telling you to share it and stuff, but I really like how it's, it is actually the minifigure in this, like just, it's the, what they use to design him, and it's in the background, I really like that, looks good. Um, I'll sit down, just want to sit up. Um, and then on to the actual minifigure, he's really, really detailed, and I really like it, and it's going to be really good for some of these winter mocks I'll be doing up in a bit here. Uh, I'll just give you some shots of the body. Let me get my thing out of the way. Really detailed. He's got, he comes with the overmolded STG44, and the, I think it's the, I think it's turned as the walnut one, because the other one that it comes, that usually comes with, or the other one, other overmolded STG is a lighter brown, I don't know if you can see that, but compare the two, this one has a darker brown stock, I like this one a lot, and then well, honestly one of the main things I really like is this uh, printing that they put on the Panzerfaust, that, uh, it has instructions just like the real ones would. It's actually pretty easy. If it loses the focus, maybe. No, but it. Here you go. You can see it a bit. It has like almost just scribbly lines that are actually pretty detailed for being on a Lego piece. And then let's give you some pictures of the sides and stuff. Because of the winter stall home, which is a thing that they released individually, but I really like it on here. Splinter camo on the bottom. It's the legs. And then under the overcoat. And then overall, I mean, I just, it's really a nice fig. It was, it was like 35 bucks, but I'd say it's definitely worth the money. I think they are sold out at the time, but if they do ever come back on sale, I don't know. It might not, but if they do, I definitely recommend buying it. And uh, so thanks for watching. I'll hopefully be uh, posting some more in the next coming weeks. I've just been real busy. Thank you guys.